Federal prosecutors called it the largest methamphetamine bust in state history. And today, 40-year-old Rigoberto Ramirez Aldava was sentenced to more than seven years in prison for conspiracy to distribute the drugs. This is high purity methamphetamine that was coming from Mexico. Uh, the investigators were able to get in contact with the defendant, uh, make a couple purchases of extremely pure methamphetamine from him. Uh, he was then arrested and a search warrant was executed. Court documents say in July of last year, an undercover buy was arranged for the Mall of New Hampshire parking lot. Investigators say when they searched Ramirez Aldava's car and the El Patron sports bar and grill he operated in Manchester, they found a total of 6.7 kilos of methamphetamine. Authorities say the drugs were 99 to 100 percent pure. You usually see this kind of purity and this kind of quantity on the West Coast. Uh, to get a substantial amount of methamphetamine like that here in New Hampshire is very, very troubling, and we're very happy that we got it off the streets. But defense lawyer Bjorn Lang says Ramirez Aldava was coerced into selling the drugs in New Hampshire by Mexican drug lords who were assaulting his brother, who was locked up in a Mexican prison. Inmates uh, uh, gang up on people who are weak. They also uh, extort in, in Mexico. They extort uh, ransom money uh, from uh, uh, from family of prisoners who were in Mexico, and that's exactly what they did with my with my client. Prosecutors say when Ramirez Aldava completes his sentence, he will most likely be deported back to Mexico. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Andy Hershberger, WMUR News 9.